If you get a whack to the head without protection, then it's highly likely it could bruise or damage the brain. You can get bleeding in the brain or around it, whatever. It causes a lot of damage. This cutting from the Healthy Bastard movie just reminds you how soft that brain is in there and how easily damaged. Have a quick look. We've got this hard head. You can't get across to people, mm -hmm. can you? Mm -hmm. They've got a really hard head. Yes. But the brain is so soft. It's extremely soft and uh, jelly-like. And, and So I no wonder it shakes. It is really yeah. important for people to realise you're only born with one brain. It has yeah. to last you for the rest of your life. And Absolutely. so you really need to look after it. You need to avoid all those risk factors that I mentioned. Yeah. And you have to be very careful not to have too many head injuries, or when you have one, it pays not to have another one for a very long so, time. So do you really encourage never. people wearing a helmet? Yes, yes, for definitely. Bikes, rugby? Would, well, uh, head protection, where it is practical, is yes. to be recommended. I mean, some people don't like head protection because it encumbers what they're doing, and they're trying yeah. to come up with all sorts of excuses why they shouldn't be wearing it. But yeah. Now, I know Phil Hughes's accident was a freak. He was actually hit at the side of the neck which wasn't protected, and that ruptured an artery and he was gone. But look, a guy in Israel was playing cricket, uh, he was the umpire, and the ball struck off uh, a bat and hit him on the head, and he was killed outright. If he was wearing a helmet, he would have been all right. So this week's health tip is clear, folks. Make sure you have protection of your head during recreational sports. Mountain climbing, motocross, trail riding on your push bike, canoeing, baseball, cricket. It doesn't take much to get a well-fitting helmet. And with modern helmets, you don't even know that silly things are on. But by jingos, it'll protect your brain if you get a decent whack to the scone.